Hi everyone, I'm Donna from What The Redhead Said. I'm filming again today um, to join in with Colette and Katie's vlog stars. They give you a topic each month and you've got a couple of weeks to film a video and talk about a subject that they give. This time it's things that really wind you up. Now, I'm quite a laid back person. I don't get too stressed. I don't let things really bother me. But there are a few things that really do wind me up. Um, let's start with an obvious one. People who don't have kids parking in parent and baby parking spaces. Why? Why do you need to do that? There are so many other parking spaces you do not need to park in a parent and baby one unless you have a baby, toddler, small child, whatever. If you don't have a child with you, park somewhere else winds me up. That's the one thing that really, really, really winds me up. And I beep at people and I shout at people and I get really annoyed. Um, mainly because that space is usually mine and they've taken it. What else winds me up? Temporary traffic lights. Temporary traffic lights on a roundabout, on a four-way roundabout, when you end up having to sit there for half an hour whilst it goes through every set of lights. Ugh. And it's always on the school run as well. Temporary traffic lights on the school run should just be banned completely. I hate them. I get so angry. Rove ragey. But I don't really get rage ragey. I'm quite a relaxed driver as well. But temporary traffic lights, I think, push anyone to their limits, really. On the theme of driving, I also hate pay and display car parks. The ones where you actually need physical cash to park. I never have cash, ever. So needing cash to park... Ugh, oh, why can't they change them to the ones where you pay by phone or where you pay by card when you come back to your car? Like, how do you know how long you're going to be anyway? I don't want to have to guess whether I'm going to be two hours or three hours. I'd like to maybe be allowed to have two and a half hours and then just pay when I come back. Also, pay and display machines where you need change, where they don't give you change. So, council car parks where the charge is 40p. They know you're only going to have a 50p, and they take that 10p every blooming time. That's like daylight rubbery. Modern day theft, that is. And it winds me up completely. That might be it. I don't know if I've got anything else that winds me up, really. My husband, when he leaves his socks in the middle of the room, or all around the house, Big things don't really bother me, but little things when they're constant. Oh, dirty socks all around the house. The kids do it too. They leave their socks everywhere. Dirty socks all around the house. That really winds me up. And... I don't know. Mood hoovers. Mood hoovers wind me up. Do you know those people who never say anything positive? They always say that life is rubbish and there's always stuff that's going on with them that's just depressing and it's always ugh. you know when you're talking about going on holiday and they tell you that there was I don't know a robbery there a couple of years ago or that there's problems with the flights this weekend or they went there and they got food poisoning or you tell someone that you're poorly. Oh, I'm not feeling too well. I've got a cold. Well, they are dying. They've got man flu to the most extreme level. Um, or, you know, they just they just can't let anyone have anything nice, you know. Oh, I'm getting married. Oh, I got divorced. Lovely, you know. It's just sometimes you just don't need to hear it. And there are people who, I think, spend their whole life trying to bring other people down. Mood hoovers. They suck all the positivity all the energy, all the nice out of everything. People that don't pay invoices on time. You send someone an invoice, you say, right, you've got 30 days to pay, and then three months later, you're still waiting to be paid. And most of the time, it's the small amounts where it's like 50 pounds that they're not paying. Why do you need three months to pay? Sometimes I think they're just lazy and just can't bother to pay. Other times I think they do it purely to wind me up. Unpaid invoices really, really, really do wind me up. Also, people that spend their whole life on Twitter just looking for an argument. Oh, really? Have you got nothing better to be doing? Those people who scroll through Twitter and just take the pee out of people 
who pick on people because they've accidentally had a Christmas tweet go out in May or who just twist things that people say. Just get a life, get over it and put some happy in your life. You don't need to spend your whole life trolling people on Twitter or, you know, winding people up on Twitter. Just focus on yourself. Don't focus on what other people are doing and get a life, really. Those people wind me up. Just live and let live, really. And I think that's it. That is it. Not much winds me up. Those things wind me up. But I'm generally quite a relaxed and happy person. So that was Vlog Stars with me. And that's everything that winds me up. If you've enjoyed listening to this and listening to me say wind me up a million times, then click the thumbs up and subscribe below. And I'll come back and talk to you about something else very soon. Bye.